Slot Car News, sponsored by LEB Hobbies, your specialist in home and hobby slot car racing. Can you see my breath? Uh, you probably can't, but it is cold <laughs> down here in uh, Bat Cave, Slot Cave. Friday, time for news, time for news, time for news. I don't know why I'm doing that. Area 71 starting off things this week with a cool new trailer. It's a trailer you pull behind, not a trailer you watch. Anyway, um, yeah, cool stuff. Uh, Area 71, they really got some great stuff that they do. Uh, and it's cool to see them doing something aside from just uh, bodies, cars. Uh, a trailer, yeah. I think this would be, there could be some really interesting other trackside stuff that they could do. Um, but a trailer, that's cool anyway. That's definitely cool, regardless. What am I saying anyway for? I'm a little keyed up this morning, folks. Had a nice big cup of coffee. Anyway, you don't care about that. BRM 124 scale cars. That's what BRM do. They have three new Escort liveries. That's what they do as well. Uh, beautiful new liveries on these cars. If you're a, uh, a fan of 124 scale, you got to get yourself some BRM cars. These look really, really beautiful. Add to uh, quite a stable of uh, 124 uh, touring cars, small GT, vintage GT, classic GT, whatever you want to call them. Beautiful stuff. They run really nicely, too. Um, we have... Ah, yes, we're going to jump in now with uh, a little bit of... Uh, well, the Revo slots, the 510s, finally, uh, a lot of pictures have finally, just checking to make sure I'm still in focus. Yes, I am still in focus. Uh, the, the 510s have finally broken cover in a proper way on their Facebook page. Thank you, Revo slot, for uh, posting a bunch of photos of your cars on your Facebook page. Thank you, thank you. Let the world see how beautiful your cars are, please. Beautiful stuff. What have they also posted? They have also posted uh, part sheets. Yes, I continue to harp on the part sheets. And many, many uh, companies are now doing this, regardless of why they're doing it. It is fantastic. Uh, slot at Policar, you have to go to their websites to see this. Um, in any case... Revo Slot are doing this with this uh, with the 510s. It shows you the stock parts as well as the optional parts. It's just fantastic. More information. Yes, please and thank you. We do love that. We got a whole bunch of Slot and Paul Car news now. Breaking overnight, the Porsche Canadian dealers livery on the Le Mans uh, 1987 962. Anything uh, Canadian livery is a personal favorite of mine, and there you go. We have uh, this beautiful car. Finally, we're uh, getting to show, and uh, well, finally, we've shown this before, but finally getting to say it will be coming fairly soon. It's one of the next uh, releases that they've uh, an announced to their dealers slash distributors that will be available shortly. Yes, yes. Also, also, a, a beautiful, beautiful car. Hopefully, we will get uh, this in wide distribution here in the U.S. The 512M yellow car, Turgal livery on this car. Beautiful livery on this car. Oh, baby, do these cars run beautifully. And oh, baby, does this look nice. That's the stuff right there. We are going to wrap up the news with a bit of home series Policar news. They had uh, released the BRZ slash FRS, you know, when they had gotten into um, releasing sets. And obviously the first set, the drift set, came with the uh, BRZ. And now they are coming out with a, a series of the, uh, the home series uh, STI Subarus in a number of different colors. According to my notes, we have blue, teal, silver, 
yellow, orange, and red in some enticing colors, as you see here. Uh, these are beautiful, beautiful uh, colors on these cars. Basically what they had done previously with the, uh, the BRZs and also with the Monopostos. Uh, the good thing about these cars is the Home Series cars, they have a slower motor in them, which is fantastic. They have uh, slotted rubber tires, which is fantastic. Go perfectly on my Policar track, by the way, of course. And uh, they also have, if you wanted to change this out, they have a polycarbonate interior to get that uh, center of gravity just a tiny bit lower. As you see here, the, the part will be available. Uh, uh, I, well, who knows, but probably uh, when the cars will be available. I think this is a great thing. Also, these are not expensive cars. Um, initially, I think when uh, uh, Hornby America was still the distributor for Policar Slot It, uh, they priced these cars entirely too high. But now I'm really hoping that these cars... Uh, uh, kind of catch hold because Policar have done a really cool thing here with some these are very these are good quality cars guys these are not you know cut corners kinds of cars they're the 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 motor is nice it's not a fast motor not all motors need to be fast to have fun guys and as as we know here I mean you know the folks here know that but uh you get quality tires on there which is you know a lot of the quality of the car is the quality of do the tires grip. Yes, there's a magnet with these cars. You can uh, easily remove the magnet. It's a flat chassis, um, so it's not a it's not a hard car to uh, tune a little bit and just kind of enjoy as a group. I know some uh, some some guys here uh, actually in PA that enjoy racing the BRZ uh, as a class, and yeah, I mean you race these cars. As a class, and I think you got a really uh, compelling club slash starter series that's not hard for new people to get into. And the cars, quite frankly, are really good value. And I think uh, these cars deserve a lot more attention than they've gotten. The home series of cars, because, I mean, these should be very reasonably priced here in North America. And, I mean, if you're not into the Subarus, Trust me, I get that. Uh, they're going to be releasing uh, Maserati GT4s at some point, probably in these colors, although I'll be honest, I don't know. I, I would assume that it'll be this kind of finish on them. And I think that's fantastic stuff because uh, the more options we have, the better. Long, I know, but I feel passionately about this stuff. It's good quality stuff and uh, deserves more attention than it's gotten for sure. Stick around, guys, after the racing and show news. I have added another couple uh, pieces to the racing and show news. If anybody wants uh, racing and show news added to the, uh, to the news here on Slot Car News, just email me or message me or whatever. And uh, we'll be back right after this to wrap up the video. Thanks, everybody, for sticking around. I really do appreciate it. Um, I don't know if I'll be able to do a live stream this weekend. I will try to do one. Uh, look for the notification if you see a notification. Usually um, here on the channel, there's uh, I will put a, 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 a message on the community tab uh, that you should get a push notification for if you have those set up for all notifications here on the channel. And um, I'll try to... Uh, 
do a live stream if I do one. It'll be at the usual time, 4 p.m., like I've always done on Sundays. And, yeah, um, if I see you then, thanks very much for showing up for that, for this, and I'll see you soon. Thank you.